goes fast. So the, the it goes really fast. It feels hard. nice off the foot, to be fair. Isn't, yeah, because you don't nice. kick it so hard and the ball flies. It feels strong, doesn't it? Yeah. Like this. You can see here, it's nice to kick. That's better for you, don't know, Pete. I think it's, it, it, I think the, the ball is quite nice, <laughs> to be fair. As I was worried about the shape yeah. of the colors, but it's fine as well, isn't the visual part of it is uh, like neutral. Everything and first when I saw the ball, I saw a very nice looking ball, but if it's going to be disturbing much when it flies, I would say no, because when the ball is in the air, it, you hardly see the, the, you know, too much colors because the white one is very really dominant. So I think in, in, in this aspect, no problem for the goalkeeper. As I said, it's nice to catch. It feels good in the in the, in the hands, and um, as well, kicking it got a good control when when uh, when I when I try to kick it. So I think um, I like even the way that there is not not many cuts on the, on the ball. That is quite solid and, and, and all together. So this is this is a new new for me as well. And and uh, I think it's, it's a good uh, it's a very good idea. I think that the shape of the ball will be the same after playing. You know. So that's uh, that's that's a positive part of it as well. I think with this ball, it feels, as I was saying before, quite true in its flight when you hit it cleanly, which is what you want, and I think it's what everyone, the keepers want. But if you can hit it with different techniques, then you can get movement, which is part of the skill level. So I think it's a, it's a very good ball really for both sides. <laughs> Now we've got so many players they can they can hit the ball that it goes really high up and then suddenly drops down so fast that for the goalkeeper is very is very difficult but it's not it's not uh, something uh, it would be only because of the ball it's just the players they try to to make this uh, movement uh, to happen and and uh, everyone trains with the ball to, to you know to, to make as many as problems they can to the goalkeeper which is not So I say that uh, every ball has a movement, everyone, but it depends how fast the ball is. So sometimes you've got the, the movement from the, from the different brand and then, uh, then the, you, you easily can recover because the ball is not that fast. But with the, with the ball like this, when it goes really fast, the Champions League ball goes really fast, then uh, when, when there, there is a movement, of course, it's, it's more difficult to, to react. But uh, it's because of the speed of the ball, it's not, it's not because the ball is is, is wrongly made or something like that. It's just because every ball has a has a has a movement. You know, you can you can change it, but uh, this is the speed of the ball who makes the difference. More distance. There's obviously a lot of human error in football, and sometimes on certain days, maybe um, you catch the ball wrong. And um, as players, maybe we look to criticise the ball. I think, as I said before, um, all balls these days, I think, are very. The technology is so advanced that I think, and all balls have the regulations that they have to be. So, I think if players are, are moaning about the size or the weight, I think it's probably football players. <laughs>